Profanity warning. This channel frequently utilizes the use of profanity. Those of an overly sensitive disposition in regards to the use of such language should be advised to not continue watching, lest their feelings be hurt or their attention-seeking ways be awakened. As for the rest of you that wish to go on, welcome to the shit show. What is up guys, we are back with another voice play reaction. Yes, I know it's very, very soon after the last one, but I was inundated with people telling me I should check out the Halo theme tune. Um, now, I do game, I do uh, stream on Twitch. Um, however, I have only ever played Halo 3 um, <laughs> on a friend's computer once. Um, so yeah, but I love... Uh, the gameplay. I've watched lots of people play it and watched the storylines and everything and I love Halo in, in and of itself as a franchise. Uh, so yeah, I thought I'd give this a go. This is voice play featuring Scott Porter um, who I don't think I've seen with them yet. So this is going to be interesting. Now, before we get into the video, we've got to do the bullshit. If you like the video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Why the fuck not? Don't cost a thing. And if you want to watch more of my content, don't forget to press that red button and stimulate that bell. We all love a bit of bell stimulation. It is true. It is proven. We know this. Anyway, let's get into the reaction. I'm sorry, what the fuck? No. Oh my god. I was not ready for that. <clears throat> there we go. Now ready. Oh, Caesar. Oh my god. Lane, fucking beautiful percussion. And then that fucking nut rattling fucking bass coming out from the depths of hell. Oh, but those angelic tones from Scott and Caesar and Ellie. Fucking hell. It's a vocal bukkake party again. Oh, Jesus wept. This is beautiful. Gotta to listen to that again, Caesar. What the fuck? Oh my god. Oh my god, those syncopated rounds that are coming in. That is fucking beautiful. Anyone else thinking that the sort of tempo that they're using and that the way that they're amalgamating these harmonies is very sort of, I don't know, it's just bouncy. It reminds me of Michael Jackson back in the day. You know what I mean? Just that rhythm and the beat. What the fuck, Ellie? Hello. Go on, Jeff. Ooh, that was visually fucking beautiful. Oh. Oh, my God. Oh, 
shit. Oh, no, 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 no. You can't do that to me, Lynn. Come on. Oh, so fucking clean. What the fuck was that noise? Just that little up. I can't do it. Kind of thing. That was beautiful. Oh, I can't say enough. And I can't pick up on everything. There is so much going on. It's so complex. Jeff with those fucking phenomenally low tones. And then the bass riffs as well. And then Ellie and Caesar and Scott. All with those higher harmonies. Are fucking ins... Are you joking me? I'm trying to work here. Well. Work. Fuck about on camera. Eh. Same thing. Anyway. Be quiet. <coughs> but yeah. Sorry about that. All those fucking tones just... Bombarding my fucking ear canals. My brain is... Frozen. I know Thinky. Thinky bad. Thinky bad, listen good. Listen good. What the fuck? those sticky bombs, wasn't it? Oh, fucking hell. Lynn and Scott, both together. Jesus. Very physical feeling, very physical, visceral feeling. Oh, let me just go get a bath towel to hang off my nipples right now, because fuck, they are hard right now. What the f- And I'm not just on about Jeff's fucking low notes. It's everything. Every single one of these dirty bastards are getting a physical reaction from me right now, and I am loving it. Oh my god, boys. What's up, everybody? Scott Porter here to personally say thank you for tuning in and checking out Voiceplay's version of the Halo theme. Now, some of you may ask, Voiceplay, why Halo? And the answer is twofold. First and foremost, we wanted to pay homage to a game that had a tremendous impact upon our group for the better part of two decades now. Fair play. And second, we wanted to pay our respects to a fallen member of our own fire team, a true Spartan in his own right, Rick Dunn. You see, 20 years ago, when voice play was in its infancy, when it was still called 4 to 5, and when Blaine and Jeff and myself were just babies, a game called Halo released. And after it did, Every single one of our rehearsals ended the same way, with us huddled around a TV, playing multiplayer into the wee hours of the night. And sure, things got heated on Hang 'em High because, well, only four <laughs> guys could play at once. So if you were a low man on the totem pole, you had to hand off your controller and sit the next one out. But we had a blast. And when we went on tour, we would take the Xbox with us, along with six or seven adapters to plug into whatever TV that hotel might have. Remember those days. Kept us out of trouble and allowed us to play, to laugh, to connect. See, Halo connected us in play the way that music connected us in our desire to create. Our brother and longtime voice play collaborator, Rick Dunn, was another creator. He loved to play. He led the laughs. And most of all, he had a strong desire to connect through a community 
of artistic expression. Earlier this year, much before his time, we lost Rick, and we made a promise as a group to continue to play, to laugh, to create in his name. We urge you all to do the same. Thank you so much for listening, and Rick, thank you for inspiring so many and connecting with us all. So he was one of the founding members, Scott. Yes, I'm a soppy fucker. I cry at shit. And I don't give a fuck. That was beautiful. That was absolutely beautiful. Even without that beautiful sentiment at the end, the song in and of itself was flawless. It was amazing and it did bring back a lot of memories. But even with that message at the end, it just tied it all together beautifully. And it allowed me to realise that um, Scott was one of the founding members, or one of the early members, if not the founding. Um, I really should look up more of the history. But that was beautiful. That was very beautiful. Um, I don't know what more I can say. Uh, I don't know all the technical shit I'm learning, kind of, through this journey. Um, but yeah, for me, that that was probably the most physically impacting voice play song that I've watched so far. Um, as well as emotionally. Although um, I'm probably going to get emotional at Moana because that's something for me and my daughter. But yeah, that was absolutely beautiful. Thank you to everyone that suggested I react to this. Um <sighs> That was beautiful. I'm going to watch this again, actually, um, in a second. But, yeah, thank you so much, everyone, uh, for joining me on this amazing fucking journey. Uh, much love and respect to each and every single one of you. And, as always, onwards and upwards. Take care.